We can characterize We laugh and press unless a story And they start to describe in funny ways a group of people through a stereotype Hi there, welcome back to the channel And if you're new to the channel Welcome for the first time We have some great content That I personally think you'll enjoy So usually we do funny skits and fight challenges and all that stuff But today we're gonna be talking a little more serious I personally contacted one of my favorite YouTubers, Ethan Feinschreiber. If you didn't know, he is the Green Power Ranger on the very popular YouTube channel, Ninja Kids TV. Later, Ethan is going to tell us how he lives with autism and the challenges he's had to face. So last year I posted a video called Living with Autism and I posted that video because I wanted people to know what it's like living with autism So for those of you who haven't seen my previous autism video or don't know what autism is Basically my brain processes senses differently So my senses are basically more sensitive like of noise can be a lot louder for my ears to hear. And I have a hard time socializing with other people, which means I'm nervous and scared sometimes around people and sometimes don't know what to do and say. At first I was nervous about posting the video because I didn't know how people would respond and I thought that some people might make more fun of me because I'm different. But that was not the case. Everybody was awesome and supportive about it and it made me feel really good about making the video. So now they know what it's like to be living with autism and now I feel like they're more accepting of me. I was on the news and my school celebrated a light it up blue day I mean, how cool is that? So that got me thinking. We should be accepting of other people no matter what differences there are. Um, everybody has differences. I mean, I think you could think of a way that you're different from others. You might need to wear glasses, you might have curly hair, you might be tall like me, but that makes us each an individual person. For some people, what makes them different makes life more challenging or hard. Sometimes these differences are easy for others to notice. For example, somebody might be in a wheelchair or somebody might need to use sign language, which means talking with their hands because they can't hear very well or somebody's body parts look different. So some differences in people might not be noticeable, like people living with autism, or somebody who has a hard time paying attention, or somebody who has a hard time making friends. You can't see these differences by the way they look, but you may or may not notice them acting differently and not understand why. Here's Ethan to share more with you. My name is Ethan Feinschreiber. Um, I am on the autism spectrum. I was diagnosed when I was three years old. And it's definitely something that a lot of people don't know about me, especially when they first meet me. Um, anytime I tell someone I'm autistic for the first time, the first thing they say is, you don't seem autistic. I've never thought that about you. I've still had a lot of struggles um, compared to many other people that uh, my autism has basically caused. Um, my parents were discovered that I had it so early because everything was happening so late. Like, I learned to walk a lot later. I learned to talk a lot later. And I think the main struggle I have with it is communication. I take a lot of things literally. Um, I don't understand rhetorical questions very well. So when I think, so when they mean it's a rhetorical question, I take it seriously. So I do what they ask, but I had no idea that they wanted a different reaction or a different outcome. So no matter how or why they're different, it's not something we asked for. It's not something we wanted either. It's not like I threw a giant party when I found out I had autism, but now I realize it makes me special in a way. In fact, I feel like I have a lot of talents. So do many others that have differences. Here's Ethan to share more about that.
There are some amazing things that come out with autism. For example, I've always thought or I've always felt that people with autism are just can be very, very optimistic and very, very talented and very incredibly passionate about things they like to think about, the things they like to do. I personally have many, many hobbies um, and I don't want to brag, but I have many, many talents and I'm sure everyone else with autism does as well. Um, even people who are severely on the spectrum still have their, their talents that are just insanely good compared to other people. Um, and it's just amazing what people like us can do. Thanks for sharing that with us, Ethan. On the other hand, sometimes it's not so easy to deal with our differences. It becomes harder when other people don't treat us the same. Some people pick on us kids that are different. Some people ignore us. Some people are even afraid of us. We all have feelings, and it's very hurtful when that happens. We all just want to be loved, included, and accepted. So, I've tried not to get angry about bullying, but stop bullying now. It's not nice to people with autism, and it's not nice to people with other differences either. So stop now. You're just going to get in trouble. There is no good outcome to bullying. So I have a challenge for you. If you see somebody who acts or looks different, try to get to know them. Stand up for them, be their friends. They might be more like you than you think. We all have differences and that's what makes us cool. So press the like button if you liked this video. Tell us in the comments what your differences are. Help me spread the word by sharing this video. I put together a little slide so I hope you enjoy it. Bye. I see a true People we can characterize We laugh and friends tell us a story And they start to describe In funny ways a group of people through a stereotype But when it's pointed back at you Hold up, that isn't true The truth is that we all just want a place to fit in It's hard enough to find friends Much less with some other kid Whether it's color, age, gender, or race We get uncomfortable when someone else is different than they in our space And it pressures us to be open to change The biggest thing I think is standing as a leader I say a true Put our difference aside and let a person be themselves before we cover our eyes. Imagine life without the boundaries we create with our pride and opportunities we lose because we judge from inside. Cause the truth is that we're all equal and the answer I is love. See our true colors. Don't be afraid to let them show how beautiful like a rainbow. There's always room for change.